22 years after the supersonic British French Concorde took its final flight, a prototype aircraft made by US tech company Boom Supersonic took to the skies. The company intends to make commercial supersonic travel possible once again. Boom's XP-1 jet passed multiple tests after successfully breaking the sound barrier. It happened during a test flight over California's Mojave Desert on January 28, 2025. The XP-1 completed 11 test flights with each one steadily increasing speeds. The 11th flight reached Mach 1.1, equivalent to 1.1 times the speed of sound or 1,358 kilometers an hour. If successfully developed, traveling between London and New York will take just 3.5 hours, while London to Miami will take under 5 hours and Los Angeles to Honolulu will involve a 3-hour flight. Boom has already secured orders from some of the world's leading airlines. But like all ventures, challenges exist. In Boom's case, these challenges are similar to those that retired the Concorde. Extremely high costs for fuel and special components, supersonic engines also produce exceptionally high levels of noise pollution. As such, the planes will not be allowed to travel near densely populated areas, which means the aircraft will only be able to land and take off from a limited number of isolated airports or airstrips. Because of these challenges, Boom will have to sell its tickets at a higher price to cover the operation operational expenses of a flight. This means flights will be limited in terms of frequency, destination and clientele given their hefty price tag.